was Wednesday morning coming to you with another YouTube video. Oh yeah, international renowned, worldwide syndicated because a global phenomenon is here. Coming to you with another YouTube video, and uh, you know what else? I mean, the biggest icon in the space today, the most electrifying YouTuber, you know it. Come to you in another video. Alright, so here we go. Sick at the coin market cap at the time of this video. Gotta love it, come star. That's right, look at that. Trending number one, gotta love it. So that, that is, there it goes, come star. Alright, check that one out. Alright. Be a, be a bottom feeder like your boy out there and say that you found it. You found it right there at the very beginning, at the very low. Because he always finds it like that, right? But doesn't buy it. Get out of here with that bullshit, alright? It's so full of shit. I'm talking about you. I saw it right down here, man. It's the very bottom here. I saw it. Right? I saw it right there. But I didn't buy into it. Alright, because funds are low on my shitty ass dap. Because I overpaid that YouTuber, man. I thought he was going to crank out some great content, but he didn't. And... So, I'm all out of money right now, so I couldn't buy some shit coin. Alright. And, but I found it at the bottom, man. I'm celebrating right now because it was booming at the top. Oh, man, because I know how to pick them, even though I didn't buy into them. <laughs> Get out of here. Alright, so enough of that. Um, yeah, so Bitcoin. Man, a lot of people got liquidated based on this falling below 60k. And so a lot of people got wrecked and liquidated on trades and all that stuff. Pretty crazy just hearing that and reading about that out there. But I don't usually uh, trade for longs anyways. It's usually short if I do any sort of trading at all, leverage trading. And so that ties me into, boom, here it is. This is where I would just put my Bitcoin in instead. Platforms, all right? Platforms galore and more. And that's what you got to do. Diversify yourself amongst platforms. All right. None of this stuff will pay forever. We know that. I've never said that any of this stuff will ever pay forever. Never, ever. All right. And I always say you spread it out. Diversify it. That way when one fails, the other one could just continue and pick up the pieces and continue forward in the background. Right. And then you keep finding more, right? And then you keep spreading out more once again. You just keep it going. That's what we do. All right. So this is Atiora. And with Atiora, I've been in this thing for a little while now. I've already, I'm in the middle of my second cycle in Atiora. And we'll see how this thing keeps going and going, right? You know, we just keep it going. Taking it one day at a time or a couple days at a time. And usually I just take a look at look at it every couple days to see if I've accumulate any sort of minimum withdrawals and all that because it's all about just making that money right and they have a variety of plans you could choose from just ask Joseph here right that you could choose short term long term medium term uh, and of course the longer you go the higher the profits you earn over time right the short the, the shorter the plan is you won't make as much profits, but you still make profit, right? And you still get your money returned to you. Well, depending on the plan, that is, right? So that's what Atior does. Now, let's take a look at some of the plans here. Let's see if they've done anything different here. Uh, let's see. The office, all right, all that stuff. Yeah, they haven't done anything too crazy different, so that's cool. Let me close that down. And let's take a look at the plans, right? That's always important. Look at the plans. And see what they got here. So they have various plans. I'm going to switch it into USD, US dollars. So you can see, you know, the money that can go into it. So the smallest plan is altcoin, where you can make 1 to 1.4%, with the smallest amounts of money in there. 
And this is just for you, if self-assurance, right? You put it in a uh, low risk amount of money. You feel like uh, I could, I could, you know, risk putting that in and not be scared that I might lose it all, right? Because sometimes platforms, like I said, don't last forever. Timing's always everything. Uh, it's really up to you. And then you look at the next plan, five hundred to four thousand, and the percentage you make daily. And continue downwards, right? The uh, Crypto Plus, the ICO, uh, Margin Forex. And then the idea with some of these plans is that you could get your deposit return, daily withdrawals, right? This plan, same thing. This plan, same thing. Then it all changes right here a little bit, right? No, not this plan, but this plan, the Margin Forex. Your deposit doesn't get returned, you get a daily withdrawal, but your deposit doesn't get returned, meaning that somewhere between halfway to 60 um, days here that you'll probably break even, right? That, the break even point, the break, the BEP, however you want to call it. Uh, once you get there, then it's all pure profit from there on out. That's why the percentage daily earnings are higher. And essentially, when you're looking at it here, Profit for the term, 190%, you're nearly doubling your uh, crypto, right? So that's how that looks. Margin Global, this is where you will put more money in, 15000 plus. And same deal I just explained a minute ago. This is for uh, 60 days here. It's not bad. Two months, when you think about it, it's really not bad at all. Uh, these daily profits, 3 to 5%, it's pretty, pretty good. Uh, venture, this is different because this one, it's going to run 150 days and you don't run um, as in there's no deposit return, there's no daily withdrawals. So I believe with this one, you just got to wait till the very end to grab what you uh, earned and all that stuff. So that's that. And lastly, shareholder. I think shareholder would have been a a really good one if I had gone back in retrospect and be like I'm gonna go into this plan right I saw the uh, crypto plan that fits so long in the category I'm in but the shareholder one I think is very interesting yeah daily profits is a little bit less but uh, in the grand scheme of things uh, I don't know I just kind of like the shareholder plan better but I'm already stuck with one plan, and this thing, um, and this shareholder plan too is indefinite until it stops paying, right? That's what that means in this platform. Um, but that's what I like about it, this plan too, you know? Like, once you hit this and beyond, it's going to be Gucci, right? So, those are all your uh, variety of plans to choose from. Um, here's what I've done so far. So this is uh, operations history, right? The latest deposits. This should be only be one. Um, when it comes to this, because one plan is expired, and the latest plan is still in effect. So let's see here if I can find more detail here my deposits my deposits let's do it a little bit slow loading today very busy very busy site all right let me see here is it going anywhere I guess it's just right here huh I guess it's not going anywhere I'm just sitting there waiting for it. Um, oh, there it is. I thought I was, thought it was me. So, the first time I went into this, did 25 days, right? And uh, did 25 days here as well. And you can see. Actually, I'm in my third cycle. I didn't believe. I thought I was only in my second. <laughs> I'm actually in my third cycle. My apologies. So I did a 25-day terms on this one. Completed it. 
right? And this is what I earned, and then I went back in with this one, and this was 25 days as well. That one expired uh, just before Halloween here, and then I joined this one on Halloween because I didn't realize that one expired, and I joined this one, and uh, what, 13 days into it, that's what's gone into it, so about halfway there, right, 12 out of the 25-day plan. My apologies, I, I thought I was only in my second cycle. I won't, I'm in my third one already, so that's even better. And how you get started is you go to Balance Replenishment, uh, put in your preferred amount and crypto, put that in once it's in the uh, back office wallet. You can utilize it for them to uh, however you please, right? Um, yeah, so once you get that, then you go to Open deposit, pick your plan, boom, you're in. So just like that. Now let's go to funds withdraw. So let's see what's been accumulated here. So you got no tether, no tether, no tether. I see some Bitcoin, no perfect money. I do have a little bit of Ethereum, but not enough to hit the minimum here. So that's going to have to stay. This one's very close to the minimum of 500, but got to wait on that one. This one has a little bit of Litecoin, but still got to wait to hit that one. And it looks like nothing else. So, yeah, it's too bad this doesn't have an exchanger. You know, every, anytime you need an exchanger, uh, it's just too bad because, man, it's a great asset to have on a platform. So, let's see here. I'm going to put in this amount. And we'll see what happens here. Zero zero four one six three. Let's do it. Ooh, let's see if I remember that one. There it is. Successful withdrawal. So that's been earned. And uh, yeah, let's see what we got out of that one now. Let's go back to my account. By the way, at your wallet coming soon. So they're looking to release that. I'm not looking to go into that at all. And that's just the truth. <laughs> I'm not really planning on doing that. And uh, let's see here now. What is this? Um, oh, I'm closing in on rank uh, level one, I guess. So that's cool. People are starting to see... Um, this thing the potential in this platform so that's cool though um you know like i said none of these platforms pay forever right none of these platforms are you know guaranteed right and those dumbass sing brothers you know oh i predict this is gonna happen i don't recommend whatever shut up you guys are, are idiots as well as tiwi i mean all you guys are all a bunch of idiots all right you guys are the reason why people don't make money. It's all about careful planning, careful picking the right people. And um, once you get those pieces in place and play, then pff, we can always keep earning. That's what we do. Why is it I keep on earning? I just keep it going. It doesn't matter. I just keep it going and flowing doesn't matter if it's a few bucks to thousands of dollars, right? As long as we keep earning and just sticking it in the wallet every day like I do. I, I, that's what I do every day because I have multiple ones going and flowing. And that's how that works. And that's what we should all do, right? So just saying, uh, just do your research though. Uh, I'm in, um, let's see, was it three different, mid-level platforms, right? So, obviously, you have Atiora. Then there's uh, Mido Finance. And uh, the only other one would be Elevate Pass. All right, Quatera recently decided to go away. So, Elevate Pass. I'll be doing a highlight first thing tomorrow morning. And you can check that one out on Elevate Pass. All right. And so, uh, what else is there? I guess that's all for now. So, links down below. Comment down below. Let me know what you think. And by the way, join my Telegram group. 
you know, we can chat it up, content and more. And other than that, I'll see you in the next one.